Hey everyone, and welcome back to yet another Christmas eShop deals video. Now today's is going to be a little bit different because we're going to be focusing on the best deals that are under $10. Now first, before jumping into anything else, I want to say happy holidays to all of you out there watching me right now. And at the same time, I hope you're with your loved ones, opening up some great new Switch games or some eShop gift cards. Now to celebrate the holiday spirit, and since this is an under $10 list, I'm boosting today's eShop gift cards to $10 a piece. So the winner of the cards today, who's left comments in the last two videos, will be getting each a $10 eShop gift card. After today, we'll most likely be going back to the regular giveaway, but just don't forget to drop your comment down below and be subscribed to the channel so that as soon as you watch the next eShop deals video, you'll have a chance at winning at least a $5 eShop gift card. If you want the full contest rules, check out the description down below in the video. Now, once again today, all the games are either going to be at a brand new lowest ever price or equivalent to the lowest they've ever been, and on top of it, they're all under $10 most likely going to be another rapid fire format since right now this is another unexpected video and I want to be able to get back to my family and to the festivities. But now with all that out of the way let's jump straight into those deals just don't forget as you're watching the video if you do like what you're seeing please consider hitting that like button. Now our first great game for today is going to be Risk of Rain 2 that is right now 75% off dropping to only $6.24 and this one will be running till January 1st. Now we do have a lot of roguelikes currently on the Nintendo Switch but 3D action gameplay is not the general format we see. And I've got to say that Risk of Rain 2 is probably one of the best versions of that style of gameplay that you can currently get on the system. And what I also love to point out about this game is that it got a ton of love and care because when it originally released it did have quite a few issues but it got so many updates and the developer put so much into this game that now it's actually a pretty great experience. And personally I love supporting developers that take the time to take care of their games. Now the next deal on our list would even easily fit under the $5 mark and that is Dicey Dungeons that is now 80% off dropping to only $2.99 and this one will be running all the way to January 5th. Now this is yet another roguelite but once again in an unusual format, basically combining elements of board games with RPGs. And let me tell you, this game took me a long time to try out and I actually was kicking myself for quite a while for not experiencing this game any sooner. Number one, it is extremely addictive. Number two, it is very easy to get into, yet at the same time very hard to master. And although it's pretty much a staple of the roguelite format, the fact that every class in this game plays out so differently also adds another level to that replayability. If you want a no-miss pickup for this holiday season at under $5, I would say Dicey Dungeons is one of your best options. Now the next deals I want to take a look at are actually a couple of games that are on sale, with both Guacamelee Super Turbo Championship Edition and Guacamelee 2 Complete that are both on sale. Now the better of the two deals currently is the first one that is 80% off, dropping to only $2.99, but you can also pick up the second one that is 75% off, only $5.62, and both of these running till January 1st. Now the second one of these games actually made my list of top 10 metroidvanias currently on the Nintendo Switch and I would personally say that the first one was very close to making it as well. But basically these are two great metroidvanias that are done with a different style where number one you're playing as a Mexican wrestler with some great wrestling inspired moves and number two the storylines are full of color and actually quite a bit of humor. And both of these games, I would have said, are great pickups even at their full prices. So right now, at a crazy low price of $3 for the first one and $5.62 for the second, these are once again insane deals. Now our next deal is actually from the same developer as our previous one, but it is a totally different experience and that is Severed. That is now 80% off, dropping to only $2.99 and once again running till January 1st. Now, out of all the games on today's list, I would say that Severed is among the most original experiences on the list, because this is a game that primarily uses the touchscreen. And I know a lot of people have issues that basically relate this to mobile-only games, but let me tell you that Severed is a great game, whether or not it actually has that in common with general mobile games. 
Not only that, but the visuals in this game are so stunning that if by any chance you might have just gotten a Switch OLED, this is one of those games that will seriously have an enhanced experience with that new console. And at $3, once again, this game is a total steal. Now the next great deal that I want to take a look at is Shakedown Hawaii that is now 70% off, dropping to only $5.99 and once again will be running till January 1st. Now, if you've ever played the old school top down Grand Theft Autos, you'll be very much at home with the basic design of Shakedown Hawaii. However, at the same time, don't think of this as just a Grand Theft Auto clone because this series really does a lot to differentiate itself from that other one. Basically, you're playing as an aging CEO that his business is basically failing because of online shopping and you have to come up with special ways of rebuilding your empire. Now, with the word Shakedown in the title, I'll let you fill in the gaps in that storyline. But basically, at $6, if you're a fan of open world type gameplay, this is a great one to be picking up. So now it's time to take a quick break and announce the winners of today's $10 eShop gift cards. And our first winner for today is going to be Kevin Miller, who said, The sizzle reel was definitely sizzling with Curse of the Gods. And you are definitely right, sir. Curse of the Dead Gods is a truly great roguelite that is currently available on the Nintendo Switch. And our second winner for today is going to be Brandon DC, who basically said Okami back on sale might have to snag that one. And once again, Brandon, that is a great game. And the good news, if you haven't picked it up yet, well, this gift card is going to help pretty much pay for the game. Now, all you have to do to claim your gift cards is reach out to me in my pinned comment down below. And by the way, if any of you are wondering why I didn't mention that I was going to do $10 gift cards for the after Christmas sale, is I didn't want a bunch of people leaving comments only for that reason. I wanted it to be the regular viewers that are always leaving comments to have a chance at the giveaway. So now, if we jump straight back into those deals, our next one is going to be on Hyperlight Drifter, the special edition that is now 50% off, only $9.99 and will be running all the way to January 6th. Now, at its heart, Hyperlight Drifter is a top-down action RPG. But for those of you that are wondering if this is a Zelda-like experience, I would say it's a very different beast. Number one, this one is very focused around combat, and at the same time, the difficulty level is very, very high here. However, if you're up to the challenge, this game has a phenomenal gameplay style combined with some pretty great visuals. Definitely an amazing pickup at only $9.99, and one of those games also that doesn't go on sale very often. Now for our next entry, I'm slightly cheating, and that will be for Darkest Dungeon, that is currently 60% off, dropping the regular version to $9.99, and the deal will be ending on December 31st. Now the reason why I say I'm slightly cheating for this one is although the basic edition does come in under $10, there's also the Ancestral Edition that's currently on sale with the DLC at $15.99. And if you want to jump fully into this game, it is definitely one you should consider even though it's above that $10 mark. But ultimately, any version you go with, you're getting an amazing game. And this is a roguelike turn-based RPG. And ask anyone who's played it, it's one of those games that just never lets you get at ease with its gameplay, where at any second, things can turn around on you. But that crazy, high-tension gameplay is also one of the main reasons you'll just keep coming back to this game time and time again. And at these prices, this game is just an amazing pickup. Now next on the list, we have another game at a brand new lowest ever price, and that is Ageless. That is 86% off, dropping it to only $1.99, and this one will be running till January 6th. Now in my opinion, Ageless is one of those underrated puzzle platformers currently available on the Nintendo Switch. It has a very original gameplay style where you can alter the age of animals, plants, and different elements of your surroundings to help you solve and progress through the different puzzles. And although it has a minimalistic presentation, I love the use of colors here, bringing bright, vibrant worlds to life. And I will definitely tell you right now, if you're a fan of puzzle platformers, at only $1.99, this should be an instant pickup. Now next on today's list, we have a complete series that is on sale with a couple of entries coming in at under $10, and that is the Final Fantasy series. Now the two games coming in under $10 that I definitely recommend picking up are Final Fantasy VII and Final Fantasy VIII. 
If you want to splurge for an extra 50 cents, you could even get Final Fantasy IX with all 50% discounts or more, and basically all running till December 31st. Now, although I could almost say that every game from the Final Fantasy series are great pickups, I would say that if you've never played these games, Final Fantasy VII and Final Fantasy VIII is what really put this game series on the map for the general audience in North America. And that's why I'm saying that if you want to spend less than $10 on some amazing RPGs, I really don't think you'll be disappointed with either one of these two entries. Which one is the better, I will definitely not get into in today's video, but either one of these are ultimately amazing RPG experiences. Now, in the same spirit as Final Fantasy, we also have multiple entries from the Shantae series that are currently at under $10, among which is my favorite one, which is Shantae and the Pirate's Curse, 50% off, only $9.99 and running till January 1st. Now, yet again, you have another entry that was on my top 10 list of Metroidvanias currently available on the Nintendo Switch. And if you're a fan of that style of gameplay, you will definitely not regret picking up Pirate's Curse. However, for those of you that maybe have already played Pirate's Curse, but not the other entries, I do want to give a quick shout out to Risky's Revenge that is also currently only $4.99 and also the base version of Half Genie Hero at only $9.99. So if you maybe played already Pirate's Curse and you were looking for another entry in the series at a great price, well, those two are nonetheless great pickups. And now I guess you know what time it is. It's time for the sizzle reel of deals. And once again, it is packed with some great games.
But now that was pretty much it for today's video. Now I want to know what are you guys picking up for the holidays? What games did you maybe even get for Christmas? Also, if you haven't picked up all the other holiday sales videos, we're now at the fourth entry in the series. Definitely check out the other ones. They are also packed with great games of all prices. On the way out, I just want to remind you all that I wish you a happy holidays and a very safe time out there. Also, I want to thank the channel supporters. I appreciate their support a ton. And don't forget that if you did like the video, please consider hitting that like button, subscribing to the channel if you aren't already, and hitting that notification bell so you know when all my future content comes out. And as usual, I hope I'll see you in my next video.